everyone, it's Selena here at Amoric Fabrics. Welcome back to another Junk in My Trunk. I have such beautiful things to share with you guys. I have, um, I think, a total of 20, 23 packs for you guys here. And what they are, I can't wait to explain to you guys. Well, welcome back. It's been a while since I did a Junk in My Trunk. I have a whole bunch more stuff um, that I have for this series. And I just finally got caught up uh, from the last... Uh, uh, series that I did with you guys with junk in my trunk. If you're new here, don't forget to thumbs up, like, and subscribe. This is a crafty channel, not only uh, craft-wise, but I do sell vintage um, crafty items that uh, will help you through crafty projects. I have an Etsy shop, shop called Amore Fabrics. Down below is all the information you need, all the links. Um, we have a uh, we got what, a Facebook group, and we have Instagram, which I always post what's new, what's going on, and anytime I do junk in my trunk. And those who don't know what junk in my trunk is, pretty much I get a bunch of stuff um, from different places wherever I travel, and I call it junk in my trunk. And then when I get it home, I, I do a video like this to show you guys what they are and what's in the shop and when they're ready. So you guys know they're a pack of three. Um, they are vintage 18, late 1800s, early 1900s to, the, I think the oldest book I had was, what, 1950, which I think I only had one book. But mostly these are 1900s to 1920s or 1930s. These are vintage music books. And so what I did was I had so many. So I put together 23 packs that have three books in each pack. And what you see is what you're going to get. So I did 23 listings in the shop. So to get to the shop, down below is a direct link in the comment board and in below this video to the shop. You can go there, get them while you can. I, I marked them $15 a piece. They're going to go media mail. So shipping is so cheap. It's only like $3 or something cents. But the more you get, the more you save as well. Um, and these books... Um, between three books that you do get, you get about, I think, almost 500 music pages um, and by, by getting three books in a pack. And that's what I wanted. Originally, when I got all these books, I thought about ripping them and putting them into music book packs. But then I thought, wait, why would I do that when I can provide you guys with three different books that will give you all the pages you want? And you can have the covers and stuff, because a lot of you guys like to use these for your journaling. And these covers are quite stunning in color. Um, some of them are really cool and grungy. But, okay, I'm going to top it off even better, which is so cool about these books. All right. Is all of them are bound by staples. So if you get a good, nice, handy-dandy staple thing, if you're going to use this for your journaling, is what I'm saying, if you're a journaler. If not, if you like this for home decor, sure, that's beautiful too. But if you open up these staples... Um, and pull that out. Sometimes I don't even pull it out. I just open up the staples and I start from the side and I, I open up sections and it will provide you with full pages. So what's cool about the size of these books is they're typically around eight and a half inches by five and a half inches. And so when you have a full page, it's like perfect to tie into your signature without piecing with washi tape or what have you. So that, I know that um, when you go to the listing for each and every one of these bundles, I'm going to show you. I have them marked by bundle one, bundle two, what have you. They're also marked in the Etsy shop as well. So when you go to the listing to any of these, uh, they are already all the photos are provided, the dates are provided, and how many pages you're getting in each pack. Like I said, they're absolutely gorgeous. I did do a page turn test as well where I, I turned the corner and did that to see if it would crackle or crinkle. And I didn't find any pages that does, did that kind of thing. But just wait to see these packs. Um, this video, I'm going to make it pretty quick as possible. But if you want to go see what there is in the shop, go over there and grab it down below. Um, and then come back to the video later if you want to. But I'm going to go through each pack. I'm not going to go through all pages. I'm going to show you what books are in each pack, what the book number is, and how many pages are in that book set kind of thing. And uh, so I'm so excited. So I'm going to press pause and I'm going to get the first book set and then we go from there. Okay. I had to... <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, I have, uh, here's book pack one. And this is exactly what you're getting in the very first book pack. I'm trying to get that in, in queue here. 
Okay, zoomed in a little bit. All right, so let's book pack one. It looks like um, it is the dates for these three books are from 1930s to the 1940s. Um, and in this book pack, total pages in these pack is going to be 465 music book pages um, in this three pack. Again, this is pack number one. Look how cool the first page has that. Um, there's the back. Absolutely gorgeous books. This is the front and back. And then I'm going to go to pack two here in a minute. But to show you guys how beautiful they are, just absolutely gorgeous. All right, guys, this is pack one. I'm going to go on to pack two. Okay, here is pack two. I feel like I am like going sideways today. Here's the three books that you got. They are from the 1920s to the 1940s. It's the front. There's the back. Again, all abound with staples. Here's the front of this one. How awesome is that, right? And then there's this one here, Gates of Glory. Beautiful, right? All right, guys, on to the next one. This is book pack number three. There's this one here. It looks like the dates are the 1940s to the 1950s. Just gorgeous, right? Absolutely gorgeous. Only $15, guys. This here provides you, uh, I didn't do the total here, how many pages? Um, I can calculate here in a second. Boy, I'm behind on this one. Melody's Love. Just absolutely gorgeous, right? I love how the inside book pages have like a thicker page here. So let me see here how many pages you get in this pack. Okay, 434 pages are in this total pack. Absolutely gorgeous, right? All right, guys, this is pack three. I'm going to move on to pack four. Okay, this is pack four. You, it's the 1930s. Every one of these are in the 1930s. And you get 429 pages uh, total in every one of these packs. Absolutely gorgeous. Again, you go to the listing for these and you will get all the information you can, sizes, uh, what each book provides. Again, these are the 1930s. Pack number four. Let's go to pack number five now. Okay, this is pack number five. Again, when you guys go to the listing in the shop, you will see these packs. If you see this here, you know this one has the green one in it. I think this is the only one that has that really dark green. This here is actually the 1920s to the 1930s books. This one's really cool. It's kind of got like a canvas type of uh, book cover. It's really cool. Um, this here total for all three books will have uh, 532 music pages, which is amazing. And not bad for the price, right guys? Absolutely cool. I think it's awesome. All right, this is pack number five. Again, cool how that blue book page has that music as well. Pack number five. Let's continue on. All right, this is pack number six, and this has 552 pages. This very first book is kind of worn looking on the cover, but the pages are amazing. Uh, these books are from the, oh goodness, I didn't have it written down here. Go figure. Just my luck this time, right? <laughs> this is the 1960s. So I was wrong. I guess I do have one in the 60s. Um, this one here, you should have this all written down. I thought I was all on top of things. I guess I'm not. Um, looks like 1960s is the thickest one. It's got a lot of pages. Really cool, if you guys can see. Um, not sure the date on this one. I'll look again here in a second. And then there's this green one. In this lands. This one's 1923. Absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? It's so beautiful. I got some pages I need to turn turn. All right, let's see if I can try to find the date on this. Let me press pause. Okay, I cannot find a date on that guy. But okay, 30s to 60s, which gives you guys an idea. This is pack number six. Let's go to pack seven. Okay, here's this three pack. This one here is the 1920s to the 1930s. Total pages uh, is 363 pages. Give you guys an idea. This one's my favorite one right here. I just love the dark. You can see the details in it. So beautiful. Shining lights, this beautiful blue. 
This one's got a little of that, but it doesn't really matter. It's the music pages. It's really what you really, really want. Um, all right, guys, there's that. Let me go to, that's pack number seven. Okay, here's pack number eight. I have some coming from the 1800s coming up here soon. Plus, I got some really, really retro ones coming up as well. All right, so this here is the uh, 1930s to the 1960s. This here, the, uh, the diggity bag, has a lot of some old classics um, in here, which is really, really cool. Here's this one here. Rainbow of Love. Okay, with a total of 414 pages. This is pack number eight. Okay, here is pack number nine. And this one here has a total of 403 pages. These are from the 1930s to the 1940s. How cool is that? I bet you that first page, look at that. You could size book. This one. Smile and Sing has a little red mark right there. And that is pack number nine, guys. Okay, this is pack number 10. The one in the middle is a hard back. Total pages for this one is 607 pages. Here's the first one. Um, if you can see the, the different embossed look. It's a Heminelle as well. Here's this one here. This is ranging from the early 1900s to 1960s. I imagine that was the 1960s one. So it's got blue. You can see it. All right, guys, and that one there is pack number 10. Okay, this is pack 11, a total of 473 pages. These are from the 1920s to the 1940s. Here we have it. This is like a brown. Look at this retro looking one. Here's the front of it. Back. This is like a blue and beige. I'll know how it's showing on your end. There you go. That's pack 11. All right, this is pack 12, and it has a total of 230. I think this is the smallest book pack I have in the entire pack, but it is gorgeous and retro, and, and it's just adorable. 1930s to the 1940s are these books. I mean, how often do you find that date and era? And it's just absolutely gorgeous. And it's truly vintage and it's not copied and it's perfect for your project. All right, that is pack number 12. All right, this is pack 13 and it has 317 music pages. Um, it's from the 1930s to the 1950s, which I'm sure you can guess which one's the 50s. I don't know if you can see the pale pink and the black. Totally retro. It was the 1950s. <laughs> That's what I was trying to tell you. But you can guess. It has it right on front. Even it says in the copyright as well. And that there is uh, pack number 13. All right, this is pack number 14 and has 550 pages. All three of these are from the 1930s. Again, you go straight to the listing. It'll have uh, pictures of the copyright and details and everything you need. Tons of pictures. I made sure I had at least 10 pictures of each for you guys. Again, this is the 1930s pack number 14. You get a total of 550 music pages out of this. This one's my all-time favorite one, probably because I love truly crazy vintage. And this is from the 1800s to the early 1900s, guys. So this is probably the, one of the oldest packs. I think I have another one just as old. But this one here is like an orangey color. This is blue and beige. Really cool, thick cover. This one here is the oldest one right here so far really cool. This is like a greenish and black kind of look. You can see some pencil. Like pencil can be erased. And that is pack number 15, a total of 373 pages. I Like I said, 1800s to the early 1900s. This is pack number 16, and this has a total of 392 pages. 
Um, the, the years range from 1800s to 1930s, which is really cool. This one's really interesting. It's the Cable Company. Um, it has 100 of the best songs. Oh, that was a really cool one, don't you think? I bet you has some really cool articles on the inside too. Look at that. This one's like a brown one. This is like a greenish blue. Is there such a thing? Yeah. And that there is pack number 16. Okay, this is pack number 17. This is exactly 400 pages. This is from the 1930s to the 1950s. This here reminds me of Christmas. It does not have Christmas music that I'm aware of. Um, but doesn't it look like it would be a really cool Christmas book? You can turn that into kind of thing. Um, no, I don't. It's like more hymnal than it is anything else. It's got some turned pages I need to turn back down. It's like people put their favorite pages on there and they turn it. This is the 19, obviously, 50s. It's beautiful retro red. And then this here is, uh, I think this one's the 1930s. Heavenly Praise. Really cool yellow. That is pack number 17 again, 400 pages. Okay, this is pack number 18. And it is the 1915 to 1920s. How cool is that, right? And this has 292 pages. Again, guys, only $15 cannot beat that at all. So, I mean, it's a lot of pages and a lot of beautiful vintage uh, music. So that is pack number 18. Let's go to the next one. I'm totally in love with this pack, especially the red one. Um, this here is pack number 19. It is the 1900s to the 1940s. Here, look at this beautiful red one. It has a total of 498 pages. It's almost like leathery. You can see that. Here's the spine. This one here is a blue. Gorgeous, right? Totally can see you guys making some really cool things. Or if not, just look at that. Just seeing that as like decor on a shelf, it was just gorgeous. That my own way. But come on now, I can totally again too see you guys doing some kind of book making with these. Again, this is book pack number 19, total of 498 pages, uh, early 1900s to 1940s for this pack, pack number 19. Okay, this is pack 20. I think I have 23 packs, so you guys know this one's really grungy and really cool, and I love it. This here is 1911 to 1930s. Total pages for all these books is 556 music pages. You're probably wondering why I'm telling you how many pages. Just because I know some of you guys want to know how much you're getting for your project. Sometimes it's kind of hard to show you um, books um, and how much pages you're getting. Um, sometimes they look smaller, but they're actually bigger than what you really perceive. This one here has got like a little tear at the corner. Like I said, this one has like a little grunge to the corners, which is so cool. Almost like the corners are rounded off. Um, this was a really, truly loved one. You know, for sure. Um, definitely. So this is pack number 20. Again, from the 1911 to 1930s. 556 book pages. Okay, this is pack uh, number... Okay, I got my paper here. Pack number 21. You can hear my crazy cat because it's nighttime and she does this routine where she likes to do this crazy meow. So those who have cats, you would totally understand. <laughs> This is pack number 21. This is from the 1900s to the 1930s. Uh, a total of 441 book pages. I love the colors of these. I've been trying to do like a variety of colors in each pack just in case you want the book covers for decor or either way if you're looking for your project. So absolutely gorgeous, right? Stay tuned, guys. I know the next video is going to be vintage postcard lots. I'm going to be going through every, I think I have 18 packs. A lot of floral. I separated them by themes. Floral, garden, um, and then we had, um, what was it that I did? I did Christmas and Easter, and I think uh, Valentine's Day as well. All right, so this is pack 21, guys. Okay, this is pack number 22. Um, I got those, I don't know if I told you guys where I got these. I got these at Amish Acres. They're um, in Shipshawana area in uh, Indiana, so at an Amish auction. So 
These are from 1914 to the 1930s. There's a total of 527 pages in total. Again, like I said, in the listing, I have more photos for you. Feel free if there's one pack you see in uh, the listings in the shop. But if you want more photos, I'm glad to give them. This looks like there's like a page or something sticking out. It's going to make me curious. I'm not to figure that one out. Let me pause here for a second and see what that is. Okay, it was a folded page. Looks like I need to go through there and looks like someone folded their favorite page or something. All right, guys, that's a total of 527 pages. Pack number 22. Dates are from 1914 to the 1930s. I think we have one more pack left. Okay, this is the very last pack, guys. Um, this one here has a total of 437 pages. Um, this is pack 23. This is from the dates of 1920s to the 1940s. Um, and like I said, it's the very last one uh, in the pack. These will go fast, guys. If you want to run on over there, like I said, shipping is going to be media mail, unless you prefer it to be differently. Um, and um, it's I think media mail for pack is like three dollars and something cents. It's crazy. Um, and so the more you buy, obviously, the way it adjusts and you guys save money. So. There you guys have it. Don't forget, junk in my trunk. I got postcards are coming up next, and I don't remember what else, but keep stay tuned this week. Every day I'm going to be posting junk in my trunk again. I gave you guys a break last week a little bit, <laughs> so I'm here to bomb you again with more junk in my trunk, guys. Hey, right, guys, you have a, looks like I'm already being messaged already, so you guys have a great day, and thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Bye.